Hello and welcome to a brand new channel called Bucks Coins. My name is Steve and the channel is Steve at Bucks Coins. With this channel I'll be looking at doing the normal sorts of coin hunts that everybody does. 50p's, £2. I haven't decided yet on whether I'm going to do 10p's and possibly 1 pences to try and help Christopher out with his world record. I will be coming at this from a slightly different point of view to other coin tubers in the way that I present what I'm doing. I will be doing a lot of coin hunts over varying different things as well as the 50p's and £2 coin hunts I'll be doing stuff with euros, state quarters and park quarters. I'll be also looking at pre-decimal stuff and some little bits of history of certain coins as we come across them. I hope you'll find this channel entertaining and I hope that you will join me in the future of this channel. Now as things will go on I'm sure I'll expand and do other items and different different things to do with coin hunting and coin collecting. That's very much the introduction that I wanted to give for this. So as a way of starting to show some of my collection off I've got three coins here from the Pobjoy Mint. Now these three coins are short prints or short limited issues in the way that they're presented. The first one is from Gibraltar. Now in 1840 or thereabout we created the first postage stamp in Britain. It's called Penny Black. This coin, this 50 pence coin, commemorates that penny black. Hope you can see this. Let's try and zoom in a little bit. It's the difference with this 50p to other brilliantly, brilliantly un, brilliant ones is the fact that this has a black finish to it, which can be clearly seen with the stamp itself and the darker colour of the 50p. And on the back, you can see that it's a Cooper Nickel diamond finish card in pearl black. That's the coloration 50p and it's a limited edition of 7500. The metal of the specification so it's at the top here and that's a pearl black cupra nickel diamond finish. The standard size for the 50p and the weight is 8 grams. and it's produced by the Pop Joy Mint. I went on their site a couple of days ago and there was one or two of these still left. For me it's such an unusual coin and having an understanding of stamps from my previous collections and one I've got currently, a penny black was always something I wanted to get because it was the first of its type. I never quite achieved it when I was collecting stamps but this is a special coin for me for that reason. I personally like this one quite a lot. It's uh, so different and I'm very happy to have it in my collection. Now the next two I know other coin tubers have looked at and they're both ship coins. The 
let's get them into I'll get used to this haven't I you go in the opposite direction to the way you want to go first one's the HMS resolution this is the first 50 peep on behalf of the South Georgia and South Sandwich Islands it had a very lovely picture of the of the resolution HMS resolution along with its name at the bottom and a 50 in uh, in numerals on the right hand side face of the coin is the Jody Clark portrait that's a lot of foreign dependencies and such like are using on their coins again it's a cooper nickel diamond finish 8 grams in weight 27.3 diameter which is standard and the issue for this is just 2750 which makes it a very rare coin on this particular in this particular format There you go, HMS resolution, lovely coin. The third and final coin is also another ship coin, which we seem to like a lot of amongst the collectors, us, the coin tubers. This is to commemorate the 200th and 220th anniversary of the birth of James Clark Ross. It's a picture of Victoria there. The Erebus or Erebus, I'm not sure how you pronounce it. The picture there of the actual ship itself with the denomination of 50 on the left hand side. Lovely coin again. It's always good when you've got transportation animals on coins and they tend to be very collectible when that happens. Again this is a limited issue of 2750 Cooper nickel diamond finish this particular one is the South Seas Territories I believe sorry the Antarctic Territories the Rivers is the Antarctic Territories I didn't give you the HMS resolution one. That has been made for the Sandwich Islands, hasn't it? South Sandwich, Georgia and South Sandwich Islands. Three very collectible coins. I believe all three are still available at the Pop Joy Mint. And I would recommend anybody to get them because they're absolutely fantastic coins to add to your collection. Well that's it for this introduction video, if you like it please hit the thumbs up and I would like it very much if you would join me for later videos. Thank you for your time and I hope to see you all again soon. Bye.